Are you kidding me? Right, what's up guys? Welcome back to a new Minecraft episode. So today I actually want to work on my house. Because I figured in the last episode, which I recorded just a few hours ago, uh, I went to the nether and yeah, it was very stressful. I mean, I even died once, but I still managed to get my stuff back, so it's all good. And yeah, apparently I looked up these music discs. Uh, where did those go? Are they over here? So apparently this music disc right here only has a 5% spawn rate in the Bastion. And I think it's also the most rare music disc to find in the game. And yeah, somehow I managed to find two. <laughs> but yes, today I won't be going on any big adventure. Like I said, I want to work on my house. Last night I was just watching YouTube and I found some videos of people building some insanely nice like modern type houses. I don't remember the channel name right now, but I can leave it down in the description if you guys want to go and check it out. Uh, because yeah, they built some insane houses. So I thought that I want to try and build a bit of a modern house up on this hill right here. Now this means that I would have to go and chop a lot of wood. Now, luckily, as you can see around my base, I've got a ton of these acacia trees, I believe they're called. And so I thought maybe I could stop recording right now. I'll go and do a ton of wood cutting. That's pretty much all that I'm gonna do. So I'll be right back in just a few seconds. But for me, it's, yeah, it's gonna take a long time to get all this wood. <laughs> Alright guys, I've done some farming, as you can see, there's, yeah, just a bunch of floating leaves everywhere in this area now. But I got one, two, three, four, five, six stacks of the logs. I don't want to make them all to planks straight away, I want to build the base in logs and then make them into planks later on. And I was also thinking, instead of tearing this house down, because, yeah, I'll have to move everything in the chests and stuff. What if we build the house all the way out here, right here on the end of the mountain? I'm obviously gonna have to move... Yeah, a bunch of stuff, get rid of these trees. I'm probably gonna make it like 15 by 15 and then just have multiple floors up instead of having it super big. So yeah, I think this could be a pretty nice spot, especially with the sun rising up here. Yeah, so first we just need to get rid of a bunch of stuff here and smoothen this surface out a bit. And yeah, I don't really have that much of a plan of how I want it to look. I'm just pretty much gonna freestyle it. Um, I now realize that I'm also gonna need some more sand to make the glass around it. Let me see how much sand I have. Um, or else I'm gonna have to go and farm some of that too. I don't think I'll be needing that much. Do I have any? Okay, I have 49, 64. Yeah, I got almost two stacks. That should be enough. It just feels a bit faster than, yeah, having to chop every single block down. Come on, burn faster. Here we go. I think this area might actually be big enough now that I removed the trees. Just gonna add some dirt over here to make it a bit even. And yeah, with the ideas that I have, I think I can make it look pretty nice. And if it doesn't work good on the first time, we can always just add some stuff to it later on. And make it look better. Let's just make a good base here. All right, this looks very ugly right now, but let's go ahead and get started here. One, two, three, four. Oh, I need one more block. Come on. <laughs> Always one block that's missing. There we go. All right, then let's begin making the base of the house here. Okay, this should make it 14 by 14, and we're just gonna have to work around that. I'm just gonna go sleep though to make it daytime. Okay, now let's begin by removing some gaps right here. Where I want to change it up a bit. It doesn't have to be symmetrical. I think it's gonna look a bit cooler if it isn't symmetrical. We're just gonna build it all now using the acacia planks, since that is what I have a lot of. Um, but we can always replace that later on once I got some cooler material. But this is gonna have to do for now. Okay, then we start doing something like this. That's right, yeah. Then we skip that gap and we continue over here. And actually, I want this to be a bit bigger or continue for a bit longer. This one right here, they're a bit too close to each other. We could move this, something like that, and extend that one all the way over here. And we just keep doing this all the way around. Like I said, not sure this is gonna turn out, but I think it's gonna be pretty cool. At least it's gonna be an upgrade compared to our previous little box that we have over there. I'm actually gonna make this one continue a bit further too. Going further around like this. The last one right there, okay. And I'm probably gonna connect these two actually. These two sections feel a bit too short. And then just fill that in. And now we begin working on the second layer, which will just be one higher like this, which will go all the way around on the inside, making a very nice frame. Do this. Cover up the gaps. Yeah, I think this could end up really cool, actually. Now, obviously, I'm a bit of a Minecraft noob, so I don't really know that much about, like, decorations and stuff. So maybe you guys can help me out. Give me some good tips on some cool decorations that I can add to the house here. I want to get, like, a campfire and stuff. I saw somebody use that. We can also use, like, stained glass instead of just regular glass later on. Man, I wish I could go into them and fly up so I can see how it looks from each side. But I think that looks good for now. So now we need to get up here. I'm just going to work on the second floor here. Let's see, is this right? No, it should be down here, right? Yeah, it should. <laughs> that took a lot of thinking to figure out where that was supposed to go. And then we'll just keep doing the same process going up. Pretty much as many floors as I want. I think I missed a few parts. I need to add like the logs in between here too. Actually, I think it looks better if it's 
no, not right there. I think it looks better if there's actually a nice gap like that all the way around it. Let me step back and look. Yeah, I think that's right. And then we just keep adding more layers up here to make like a second floor and stuff. But let me just go and sleep and then we'll continue. <laughs> okay, so now we need to add this similar design to this level and then we can maybe do the roof. Okay, no idea what I just built. <laughs> I actually don't know if that's correct or not. Well, it's semi-correct. I just need to get rid of this part and yeah, have these go down like this instead. Just like to do right here. That is what was messing me up right here. I wasn't really sure what to do. There we go. That's how it's gonna be. I think that is right. And now we add the planks into these gaps and one layer up. And then we can make the roof. And I'm not sure if I'll have enough glass panes here to finish this off. But maybe, just maybe I will. But don't wanna fall off here. Please don't fall off. <laughs> I actually have to eat. Pretty sure if I fall here, I die. Run back and look. Yes, that is looking so good. Okay, so last step will be to make one more floor and then some sort of roof. I think I may just have enough planks. I need some dirt though so I can like build myself up and stuff. Or I'll just use some cobblestone then. Oh, we got some spare ones right here. Let's bring those. And I'm gonna have to make a new axe here. This one's about to break any second. Psych, we got a new one right there. Perfect. Oh, dude, this looks beautiful from a distance. Look at this. Then we add the glass in here. The door can be right here, I guess. Ooh, I should make the roof glass. And then have the bedroom on top. Yeah, I'm gonna have to replace the floor in here too, of course, with planks later. But let's go and finish off the roof up here. Need to build up one last time like this. Okay, now we make the roof on top of this out of glass. But I think for now, let's just make it out of planks, right? Just so we actually have a roof on top of our heads here. <laughs> what up, zombie? You like my house? Yeah, dude, he loves it. Look at him. He's trying to eat it too. <laughs> and this will be the roof for now. We'll just fill all of this in. You know what? What if we actually don't use this material on the top floor? We just have massive glass panels on each side. Okay, so like this. And then we just make the floor right here. I think that should work, right? Okay, let's build down now and see how this looks from the ground. I'm not sure how it's gonna look. Let's see. Ooh, that looks really good. What I could do is add these logs just in each corner like that, just to kind of run it off a bit. Let's do that, and then we gotta begin adding the glass and then work on the interior. Hmm, we could do this, maybe. Add a little barrier like this. That could look pretty good from the outside. Now, we'll have to raise the roof a bit. What we could do is keep an edge like this and this takes a lot more time than building it in creative mode but this actually gives me like more satisfaction to finish the house completely in survival mode so i'm thinking we just raise the roof like this just to make it a bit higher i mean that is much better than what we just had and then we go down and see how this looks from the outside this should hopefully be the last bit of the exterior okay okay that looks really good this house is gonna make what just happened? I placed down one block and everything got super, super foggy. What is this? I don't want to build in this weather. Come on, this looks so boring. Okay, I'm just going to make some room for the floor and then I'm going to have to go and chop some more trees. Because I need more wood. I can't tell what time it is outside. Is it night time? I don't know. I'm going to see if I can sleep. No, I cannot. Okay. All right, I got some new access. I'll be right back, guys. Once I got some more wood. Okay, now it's definitely night time. The mobs are out. Let me just do this real quick. I see you, creeper. Don't try and block my farm. Let's go up and sleep and maybe the weather will be a bit better. Let's see. Are you kidding me? <sighs> How did he enter my house? Oh my god, there's so there's so much stuff. <sighs> Let's just sleep. See what happens. Get the hell off my mountain. Die. Just place everything in here. I guess I'm gonna move it all to the other house anyway, so yeah. It wasn't really that big of a deal. Just a bit annoying with a freaking creeper in my house. He even blew up my roof. Are you kidding me? Ah, it's gonna have to be like that. I don't really care about this house anymore. Um, let's head over. What is inside of this base now? Oh, oh, I got with a llama. I need this guy's lead for my horse. Give it to me. Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. Oh, stop spitting at me, boy. Sorry, okay, I just needed his leads. There we go, we got two. Let's go. That is exactly what I needed for my horse. So now we can bring him on adventures and yeah, just make sure that he's safe and doesn't run away. And there we go. I'm not sure what to do with the llamas, though. They can just, yeah, chill in my house. Are you still spitting at me? Really? Are we good? Yeah, we're good. Okay, you guys can leave now. Oh, there we go. Killed one, that one just ran away. There it is. You can chill right there, buddy. No, don't come back into my house. Don't you dare. Just gonna block him off. <laughs> Freaking hate the llamas, man. Yeah, I was actually hoping that one of those guys were gonna pop up eventually. So I can get a lead for my horse. Because that's like the only way to get the lead, I think. Can't craft it or anything. And it was kind of funny how I actually spawned into my new house. That was perfect. How did you get in? Can you jump through like this? Well, then you can jump out on this side. Yeah, go away. Dude, he was so annoying. He just kept coming back. Now we got a floor. We got a second floor up here and then the roof on top. So now I should probably go and throw all of my sand that I have into a furnace. 
to see as much glass as I can. And no, where did the sand go? It's in here, okay. This one and this one. Do I even have any coal left? I got 10 in this one, 12 in this. Yeah, I think we may have to go and do some mining in the next video. Don't really have that much coal. Never mind, I got a full stack right there. Perfect. Guys, I think I might actually wrap that up right there. We made the whole base of the house like this. So the next step for this house is gonna be to add glass and all of these open spaces. And yeah, then work on the interior, chest area and stuff like that. A nice bedroom on top is gonna look really sick. Now we'll see if I do that off camera and just show it to you guys once it's done. And then for the next episode, let's figure out a nice adventure that we can go on and have some fun. So if you guys did enjoy today's video, drop a like on it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll catch you guys later. So until then, take care.